should be excited, don't be nervous, because of course today's auction it will be conducted in accordance with any rules that are made available before the start of the auction. The auction rules prohibit an auctioneer for accepting any late bidder offers for the property after the property has been knocked down to the successful bidder. The late with them, they'll give everyone ample warning. First call, second call, third, final call, but when the gavel hits like so, she's all over, we can't take any late bidder offers for that after that point. We do understand, of course, that buying and selling of real estate is a very big decision, and we will give every bidder Ample time, pull the friend out, pull the phone out, phone a friend, have a conversation. We will give you uh, plenty of time should you need to think about whether you are going to increase your bid for the wonderful property that we have here this morning. Our doctor here, I'll indicate bidders on the floor. The law prohibits false bids, the prohibits ma um, major bidders from attempting to stop other bidders from bidding, and the law does provide fines for this conduct. The rules they do commit men to a bid, the words that I'll use throughout the auction. Make sure that I'm indicating. Make it a bit on behalf of the vendor. I quite simply say, I'll vend all bids and by law only I add the auction. If you're wondering what this gentleman is doing, we do stream our auctions live on Facebook. If you wanted to see what's happening, if you missed out on a couple of auctions and you want to see what's going on at your neck of the woods, jump on, like our page, Ray White Ringwood, and you can see everything that you've missed from the comfort of your home with a glass of red and the cold, uh, windy nights that we are into to in winter here in Melbourne. As I said, ladies and gentlemen, we sell here today by a public auction. We ask these successful bidder come inside, execute the contracts that have been on display for the past 30 minutes, pay a 10% deposit upon signing of it said contracts with the balance to be paid in settlement in your choice anywhere between 30 and 60 days time. I am aware some parties have sort of variations to those terms. This is confidence, those variations have been approved. Understand the vendors have done absolutely everything that they can to make it simple for you to buy wonderful, wonderful apartment. And what about those views, ladies and gentlemen? I haven't seen a view like that for quite some time, not at this price point. Undestructed views of the city. It's just unbelievable. At night, I've been here, it looks fantastic. Two bedrooms, two bathrooms, two car parks, of course, one is where this shed storage, whatever you like to call it, is there. They just blue board, you can just remove that, and you can have the car park, or you can leave it as a storage room. It is lockable. It is also rented out at the moment for about $50 per week to a builder, uh, which are continuing to do, are happy to continue to do that if you wanted to supplement some income or perhaps you want to kick them out and use the space yourself, either of which would be absolutely fine. For the investors, $430. That might be a little bit under market value, apparently, is what Adriana in the white coat has told us. You should expect uh, a rental return north of that number is what we have been told. Trams, cafes, parks, the Yarra River, right at your doorstep. A wonderful apartment in a wonderful location, as evidence by the turnout here this morning. It's probably not fair to me, I'll throw it over to you. You've seen it, you loved it, Dad. Chance of bid and buy it. Where do we go? Where do we start? Get me on the way. Opening bidder offer 14 slash 488 Glen Ferry Road in your hands. We've got an option for about 10 years, ladies and gentlemen. It's all made at the respective buyer. The moment of silence. One way to shut it up from here, okay? How much? 450. 450 will take it. I like it. Good luck. 450, there it is. Where do we go? Let's take a $10,000 rise. That's four and a half of 450 we got. That's 450 for the big now. 60 you said. 460, 50 I have. That's 450 now. Jump on in for 60. That's 450 now. Clear bit off it here. That's 450 now. 60 jump on in. First call, 450. Second call, 450. Third, final time. That's 450,060 we can search. I just want to remind everyone that if we do pass the property in on a genuine bid, what that means is that that person has sold the door is closed on everyone else. At 450, 60 we search. At 450, appreciate the patience, sir. At 450. Would you like to bid it all, sir? At 450, I have here, 60 we go. At 450 now, two bedrooms, two bathrooms, those beautiful views. Surely more, worth more than this level that we're at at the moment. 450 now, 60 we go. At 450, come on in now for 60. At 450, I have. At 450, the bid now, tempt you in for 60 if you like. At 450, tempt you guys in at all. At 400. Can put another vendor bid in against me? 460 with vendor, 70 where you need to be, sir. At 460, I have here, 70, get you back in. At 460, 70, can I say? At 460, 70, I search. Jump on in for 70. First call, 460. 70, we go. 
Sydney, thought about it, made sense. Good to have you back. At 400 in Sydney now, 80 seems logical, I would have thought. Let's go 470, I've got 480 we search. At 470 now, first call 470. Second call 470. She got in 480 if you like to get you in 470 I have. At 470, for any page on the back of 470, we did it often. Keep you guys in at 80. It's never good when people avoid eye contact with you when I ask them for a bit. I don't know where to look. If anywhere but at the office here. At 470, 70 I have, 80 we search. Call it three more times. First call, 470. No better bid, they get a deal with the vendor, the door is closed. In the land of options, if you want to be first, you've got to be last. 470, they have the right at the moment. Second goal, 470. Tempt you guys in for 80. 470, I have. Third, final time, at 470,000. 80? Get some instructions, Cam. Uh, one second. No? At 470. Third, final time. Tempt you guys in for 80, perhaps. Alright, let's go with me the vendor bid. Vendor bid with me 480. Suggest 500 where you need to be. 480. At 500, I'll go. 480. Not an e buy real estate, that's the one I was looking for. What about 510? 520. I'll just keep going up, you tell me when to stop. Like 40? 50? Go the other way. What about 600? I'm going to go. So this is what happens if we pass it in on the end of a bit. No one gets an advantage. For a very good smart negotiating technique. If you want to deal one on one with the vendor, close the door on everyone else. You need to be, because if we pass it on, I'm on the MRC side. You have my insurance, you bid 500, I won't bend or bid against you. Trust me, I am a real estate agent. <laughs> 500 to get you in. I'm the banker, so it even works. <laughs> 50 duo. Body and lifestyle. At four. You know what's going to happen. If you go 490, I'm going to put a bend or bid at 495, then that will take 500. So let's just, let's just save the, uh, the run around and let's just go 500. Alright, 500. I appreciate it. Thought about it, mate. It's at 500, it's definitely have. At 500, we've been now. At 500, we have here 510, I search. At 500, we've been now all the three times. First goal, 500.
Has been given. Tempt you in there. That 500 I have. Any rise I will take. 500, 505 if it gets you in. Third, final time. At 500,000. Clearly bid. We in, we out. Count, get some instructions, please. What are we doing, Cam? Are we in? Are we out? We're out. Well, ladies and gentlemen, what we're going to do is put a vendor bid at 550. At 550 with me, the vendor, 550 I have. Take a rise from there, otherwise we'll pass me at 550. At 550, any rise to get you in at all, guys. First call, 550. Second call, 550,000. Five and a half. Third, final time, at 550. Tempt you guys in at all. Well, ladies and gentlemen, what we're going to do, we're going to move to third. The uh, negotiation, the auction process. We do say options are a process, not an event. Sure, next time you drive down Glen Ferry Road, there'll be a sold sticker up. If you have interest in the property, step forward. I'd love to have a discussion with you. Otherwise, Joe, we're going to hit the phone this afternoon. We're going to get it sold very, very soon. Thanks for coming out. Have a lovely, lovely weekend. Have a nice day.